Whoopsie. I'm not sure. Alright, ready? Hi, Davey. It's Liz. And this is Rita. <laughs> and we want to wish you good luck on your mission trip. Um, bring me a postcard from Peru, please. Yeah, have fun. And don't forget us. Be back. FOC girls. All the way. I'll go first. Um, David, thank you for always treating me like a sister. I'm going to miss you a lot. I'm going to miss um, the lectures you always give me, you know, tell me what I'm doing wrong, what I need to improve on, all those good stuff. I'm going to miss that. I hope you have an awesome time. I am so proud of you. And don't come back with a wife, first of all. And just have a blessed time. And I hope that God protects you and does miracles through you. say not a lot of time uh, but uh, ever since you came back from Charlotte really felt like you came back home and uh, we all meshed together very well and uh, you know you gotta do what you gotta do and you're going on this uh, year trip and uh, I just wanted to say that um, we're all gonna miss you I'm gonna miss you a lot my friend uh, but uh, I'd just like to let you know that you know we're gonna be praying for your brother and um, just remember that when it's going to be hard, when you're going to be feeling down, when you're going to be feeling discouraged, or missing home, or missing the water, or missing a lot of things because you're going to be in a lot of places, just remember that the sacrifices you're making, the sacrifices you're making right now are for God's kingdom. And that's the most important thing you could ever do. And uh, someone once told me that in order to achieve something, in order to achieve or do something great, um, that takes sacrifice and your life and what you're doing with your life. I mean, that's a living testimony to everyone around us that you're not just preaching. You're just, you're actually, you know, you're talking the talk. You're actually walking the walk and you're doing uh, what the Lord asks you to do. So, brother, we're going to miss you. I hope that you have internet over there so you can text us or call us or, you know, keep us posted on how you're doing. And, um, hopefully everything comes back well. If you come back with a wife, uh, you know, that's, that's up to you if life happens, you know, and, uh, you know, either way, how you come back or when you come back, you just know that uh, we'll be always here for you, waiting for you, and uh, hopefully well, the good Lord blesses you and uh, keeps you safe. Uh, uh, David, I wish you the best, and that God will bless you wherever you would be. I know that you're going to be in a lot of different places with unfamiliar faces, but a lot of people are praying for you, and... Uh, you have an open mind because I know you know Americans are a little sketch sometimes you know I get that but keep an open mind God works in mysterious ways and he's way bigger than we are and sometimes we limit God in our very narrow perspective but um, open up your heart and God will show you um, incredible things. David God bless you I just want to wish you safe travels um, go be a blessing to other people go serve him uh, God's gonna bless you just trust in him and he'll provide for you don't forget us. We won't forget you. We'll keep on praying for you. Um, <laughs> return home. Make sure you come back. David, um, I am so proud of you. I'm so glad that you are going on this trip. Like, that's dedication. So happy to see that. And um, you're, you're my favorite cousin. <laughs> I hope you have a great time. I hope God blesses you on your trip. David, it's been real. Keep it real. Okay, so I know before Ukraine you gave me like some little advice and I found that really helpful so just want to wish you all the best when you're going on this trip too. I know it's going to get tiring and like you'll run out of energy but don't forget there's a whole, <laughs> stop, there's a whole church back home praying for you so you'll do great. Oh, what's up there, David? Don't mind me here, it's working out, you know, keeping strong. I just want to bless you on your trip, be a great friend, you've been a great brother to me. God bless you on your trip, come back with the souvenir. You know, he said you're gonna bring a souvenir, so don't forget about that. Don't forget to take a lot of pictures, a lot of videos. Oh, I'm getting tired here, a oh, hundred. Okay, there you go, don't forget. David, God bless you. This is such a great opportunity that you get to go on missions and serve God and touch people's hearts through um, God's word. Сам Дэвид, мои пожелания тебе, 
пойти письмо к Христову, like Bible says. Когда люди будут смотреть на твое письмо, they'll start reading the Gospels. You're the fifth Gospel. Most people do the opposite, but I want you to be like Christ, and then people will start reading Gospels and спасаться. So. so depending when you're watching this, we're either missing you or we're, we're gonna miss you. We truly are. We're, we're a big blessing for our youth, and the only thing I want to encourage you to do is continue to pray every single day. Find time every single day that you're on this trip. Spend time with God by yourself. Um, I really treasure that. And if you're watching this and you have any Bible passage you want to read out, I suggest that you read Philippians chapter three. Just read through it. Really study it. Every part of it. And really hope that you stay. As you grow in Christ, as you grow in knowledge of Him, that you can say, like Paul said, follow me as I follow Christ. So the closer you get to Him, the more you know about Him, the more you see His grace and your mercy, and the more you live like Him, that you start to show this example to those around you, and you can tell them, do what I do, because I do what God has commanded me to do. So um, God bless you. We'll pray for you every single day. Well, I'll try. I can't make promises, but I'll try to pray for you every day. God bless you. David, may God bless you on this trip, and may he just fill you with the Holy Spirit and give you the right things to say at the right time, and um, just have fun. And when it gets really stressful, like Leanna said, everyone's praying for you back home, and God is always with you. Hi, David. Um, I'm going to wish you the very best, God's blessings, with you on your upcoming 11 months trip. Um, don't be a stranger. Send us pictures. Um, and yeah, we'll see you next year. God willing. Pray that God blesses you while you go out of this country to other countries to serve other people. Um, may the Lord bless you through everything that you do and that you do it all for the glory of His name. Hello, David. <laughs> um, we're going to miss you a lot. Um, I wish you the best of all the Lord's blessings, all that He has in store for you. I hope you learn a lot through all your adventures over this next year and that your faith stretches, as you said. Um, yeah, we'll miss you. Come back um, in one piece, preferably. Bye! God bless. Hey David, I just wanted to say we're going to miss you and may God truly bless you on your trip. Um, you have been a great youth leader and keep up the good work out there on the mission field. God bless you. Stop, stop. Stop, hold on. What did I think?